In this video, we're going to be talking about Merkel cells. Now, what Merkel cells are, they are mechanoreceptors, so they're able to, re to uh, receive any kind of mechanical stimulus coming from outside and transmit it to our brain. So, uh, they are situated in the deepest layers of the skin where they receive some kind of stimulus. They have a sort of oval shape. And as you can see in these two pictures I got from Wikipedia, uh, they are situated right under the epidermis. And the epidermis is the top layer you can see. Right below it is the dermis. Now the dermis is made out of connective tissue while the epidermis is epithelial tissue. So the dermis is actually vascularized. So you're going to see blood vessels in it. Well, you're never going to see them in the epidermis, but um, the epidermis is also innerved. So you're going to have nerve terminations in the epidermis as well as in the dermis. Merkel cells are part of the non-keratinocytes. The keratinocytes are the typical cells of the epithelial tissues. They produce a protein, which is keratin, which is present in our skin, our hair. So keratinocytes are the most present types of cells in our epidermis. So non-keratinocytes are Merkel cells, then melanocytes, which are the cells which produce melanin, which give you a uh, skin color, and Langeron cells, which are APC cells, which are antigen-presenting uh, cells, which are part of the immune system.